All right, what is this? Greetings, summoners. It What's is up? I, Rise, the Rune Mage. For us to protect the future of Runeterra, it is vital that we understand its past. And you're in luck, since I've spent the last ten years here, collecting everything in this book. So, if you'll hold still for just a second, I will cast a nostalgia spell that should send us through the last decade of League I of have Legends. a Rise poster that somebody made. Things might look a little different than you remember. To FPS, you think it's my PC? That's totally normal. I think it's the okay. artwork. First up, the early days. As you can see, these were strange times. There were only 40 champions at first, myself included, and some of us were nearly unrecognizable oh, compared to our present iterations. This was the age of exploring new champions, abilities, and strange metas. <laughs> yes, that was standard. Many of these things have been reworked or phased out. Dude, what the fuck? Some look at it. Wait, you, wait, I gotta pause it. Sorry. I, dude, look at the, These things have been... Dude, I'm telling you, it was a better time. Season 3 was a better... was just a better time, man. I don't care if they say it's non... it's not nostalgia. I don't care. It's not. It was better. ...been reworked or phased out. But some things will never change. <laughs> All right, let's continue. Whoops. Oh, uh, oh, this isn't right. Sorry about that. Uh, hang on. Uh, still not right. Wait. Here we are. The dark times. You might be surprised to hear that League has had its share of miscalculations. There Season were many nine things was an that entire miscalculation. Right. In theory, but in practice, they ended up being suboptimal. Wait, so there have been eight. times when certain champions were notably stronger than others. Jax is still J that is literally still Jax. Who made this, man? Is it, are we sure this is the official Riot channel? You might. I guess not. I guess it's the League of Legends community channel. Say they were OP, but balancing has been and always will be a challenge. When you're experimenting for 10 years, you're bound to run into complications along the way. Let's get out of here and skip ahead a few years. Ah, see? Things can always get better. Summoner's Rift grew new life, and the jungle bred new and interesting creatures. Crop! New champions were released, while others were completely reworked. Strange new skins were released. Oh, wait a minute. ...were released, while others were completely reworked. Hey, they're kind of freaky. Why didn't get no nipples, though? Strange new skins were introduced and became iconic. Competition grew fierce as summoners Ooh. around the world competed Humble. to be the best. Many great moments were captured. Many great teams have risen and fallen. Above all things, the community has grown and created unforgettable moments throughout the years. I must confess that I hey. don't always understand the job. Was that what Kayla was talking about? Edible moments throughout the years. Wait, this is a little bit disrespectful. Wait, okay, okay, wait. So this is what she was talking about. Dude, okay, for, okay, okay, re okay, relax. Number one, my head isn't shaped like that. My skin is not shaped like that. What are you on about? My chat isn't that fucking normie. Why is there a random comment right here that says booty butt cheeks? Nobody in my chat ever ever says that shit, okay? <laughs> Look at this one. This was worth my wife leaving me. <laughs> I must confess that I don't always understand the jokes. Oh, and this bossy little penguin showed up. Fuck I think he's part of a new mode. I haven't participated yet. Same. So a lot has happened in ten years. But there's still a lot to be done, because as long as you're with us, we're going to keep working and reworking to make things better. Even if one of those things has been reworked like 20 f***ing times already. Ah, so that was like a, a throwback to the older times. Wait, did I get a shout-out for being referenced here? 
<laughs> Not a bad video. But dude, why do people always do that shit? Why do people always, always just fucking over-exaggerate like it's funny, dude? Kate, look at me. My head is not as fucked up as they fucking portrayed. And my body's not fucking lumpy. Fucking lumpy. That's just wrong. And people aren't spamming booty butt cheeks in my chat. And nobody in, in, in chat even has a wife to fucking leave them. Let alone a fucking girlfriend.